Understanding the stock market and its types. The stock market is a fascinating place where people buy and sell pieces of ownership in companies. These pieces are called stocks or shares, and they represent a stake in the company's assets and profits. The stock market serves as a platform for investors to trade these stocks. It's like a marketplace where buyers and sellers meet to exchange ownership in businesses. There are two main types of stock markets, the primary market and the secondary market. Let's take a closer look at each type. 1. Primary market. In the primary market, companies issue new stocks to raise capital. This process is called an initial public offering or IPO. When a company goes public through an IPO, it offers a certain number of its shares to the public for the first time. Investors who participate in an IPO become initial shareholders of the company. This is how businesses generate funds for growth and expansion. 2. Secondary market. The secondary market is where most of the stock trading occurs. Once the stocks from an IPO have been issued and bought by investors, they can be traded among investors on the secondary market. This is where individuals and institutions buy and sell shares that have already been issued in the primary market. The most well-known examples of secondary markets are stock exchanges, like the New York Stock Exchange and the NASDAQ. Stock markets offer various benefits, but they also come with risks. Here are some types of stocks commonly traded on the stock market. 1. Common stocks. These are the most basic type of stocks. When you own common stocks, you have ownership in the company and the right to vote in shareholder meetings. Common stockholders may also receive dividends if the company distributes profits. 2. Preferred stocks. Preferred stocks come with a fixed dividend, meaning shareholders receive a set amount of money regularly, similar to interest payments. Preferred stockholders usually have priority over common stockholders, when it comes to receiving dividends or assets in case the company goes bankrupt. 3. Blue Chip Stocks. These are shares of well-established, financially stable companies with a history of consistent growth. Blue chip stocks are often considered safe investments and tend to offer lower risk, compared to other types of stocks. 4. Growth stocks. These belong to companies expected to have above average growth rates. Investors buy growth stocks hoping their value will increase significantly in the future. 5. Value stocks. Value stocks are shares of companies that are currently undervalued in the market. Investors buy these stocks at a lower price, hoping their value will rise as the market recognizes their true potential. In conclusion, the stock market is a dynamic and important part of the global economy. It offers various types of stocks that cater to different investment strategies and risk appetites. Whether you're a new investor or experienced in trading, understanding the stock market and its types is essential to make informed decisions about your investments. Thank you for taking the time to learn about the stock market. If you found this information helpful, consider subscribing to my YouTube channel for more informative content on finance and investing. Your support is greatly appreciated.